goes up. So these wheelbarrow, wheelbarrow progressions, my goal in, you know, designing these is not taken away from, you know, the, the founding father, the strong man, or everyone is doing strong man and women competitions. The big thing was to try to add another dynamic to it. Um, I've never competed in strong man. Oh, I want to, but I would. I watched many of their competitions and I implemented it in my training. One thing that I have not seen was the inclusion of explosiveness from the sprint perspective. So sprinting with the wheelbarrow at full speed and changing direction. Yeah, they walk and, and turn around with it and everything like that. But how can we make it more dynamic and get more out of our athletes and even make competitions, you know, and trainings more competitive and fun if we don't add that in there? So these wheel pro progressions, I just took some agility drills, um, set the cones up in different ways, and I got after it. You know, you can set the cones up five or ten yards, you know, in front, you know, in different directions. And you just got to make sure that you get at it, you know, explode. These are good for bobsledders, wrestlers, uh, you got football players, you got even tennis and lacrosse players that can use this because of the handle, the, the, the forearm grip you know the body control you know the muscular tension and research also proves it as you'll see in the article so with these drinks you set the cones up as you would some agility drills explode through you know i was thinking i had to turn my head to get my body in alignment like we do with agility drills but the key with these were you want to turn the wheelbarrow at the angle first then you turn your head into your body in alignment i'm telling you man these are great yo uh so just try them, you know, don't knock it out like a lot of us do in the industry. We see something and we just knock it out because it's not what our favorite person wrote or say something like that. So let's just get after it. All right, peace.